floated elephant walks. So much like the elephant walk, um, it's the same, except now we're just adding load. You probably find that adding a little bit of load helps you to stay down in that position that we're looking for uh, without having to rely on the compression strength. So you're gonna set yourself up. You may not need boxes and you may need more boxes. So set it up that's suitable to you. So I'm gonna put my weights here. I'm going to grab onto them. So my knees are bent, my knees are on my chest. From here, I'm holding the weights and I'm gonna straighten that one leg, feel the stretch and then come back to both bent legs again. Now, maintaining my contact on my right leg, I'm gonna straighten that left leg and then come back again. If you find that quite easy and you're up for more of a challenge, go a little higher. So we'll add a box here. So I'm gonna start in this bottom position, slightly take the weights off the ground, knees are both bent. Maintaining contact with my left knee, I'm gonna straighten that right knee and then relax and bring it back to bend. Maintaining contact with my right knee, I'm gonna straighten that left knee and then slowly bring it back to bend. So obviously with having the weights off the ground, you get a lot more load going through your hamstrings.